Hey family, it's your girl, Chef Tommy V, and I'm so MTV. glad. And I'm so glad that you're here to stay a while with me and my main man, actually my only man, Troy. Today we're going to be making some barbecue beef sandwiches topped with coleslaw on a herb buttered brioche bun. And we're going to top it all off with this pre-made coleslaw that I put together earlier. So I want you to take this rub, I need you to press it into the meat, no different than like if you were breaking down a muscle. I will use this muscle. And you're doing a wonderful job. Thank you. So we're almost done here. I'm gonna go ahead and get our skillet hot. And once you get it in the pan, leave it. Don't move it because we need that spice to crust onto that meat. I also utilize the sides of my pan to help the sear on the side of the meat. I know you love Sundays because of what Sundays have meant to our family. Sundays and special days have always been a special day for the family growing up. With our children and our grandchildren, we get a chance to invite everybody over. We can cook, talk about Jesus, and eat. That's what Vincent Country is all about, faith, family, food, and of course, football. We can add our vegetable broth in. If you pour it on top of your meat, that sear that you just put on top of it, that's actually going to soften it and it defeats the purpose. You see how I make that all over real quick? I was about to run the wrong pattern. I was about to line up the wrong way. And she said, oh, whoa, wait, get lined up. So, Because I want to see you win. Good call. Good call. I want to see call. you win. And let's see. take it to the oven. So we have a softened stick of butter and we're just going to use a whisk to really get it to smooth out before we add in our other ingredients. Do you put a little extra for me? Sure. Because you've been doing such a good job. When you have a dish that has multiple components, every piece should be able to stand alone. So if you just had this bread by itself with this spread and it was toasted, it's gonna to be delicious. And then you add on the coleslaw, that layer is delicious. And then you add on the barbecue beef, that layer is delicious. So you have three layers of deliciousness, which makes it super delicious. I grew up around men and women who just knew how to throw down. And they just knew like, okay, you need a little bit of this, a little bit of that. The objective was to get people to come and stay a while. On Sunday, when grandma was cooking, she always gave me compliments. Mmm, that's nice. <laughs> that was a compliment. Well, thank you. So let's let this rest and we can work on our barbecue sauce. So while this is simmering, you could go ahead and get that meat ready. T, what up? You about to head back, man? <laughs> Ooh, it's about that time. It was so good seeing you, Tarana. Good seeing you, too. Love you. Love you, <laughs> Just break it down some with that knife and then use your meat cleaver and get it chopped up. I know you like that. Chop yeah, I'm chopping that back. We got just the right amount of sauce. All of the meat is coated and covered. All right, the buns, yep. get them out the oven. We're so glad that you came and you stayed a while with our family. We hope that you have a wonderful day and we hope that you were inspired by our recipes and that you too will sit down and have Sunday dinner together so that you can do a pulse check on life and engage with one another.